Hello, We're back. Gentlemen, I'm sorry for this. Not sorry. Late late Wednesday, but it's all good. Family, family emergency, so we are getting this out today. It happens, man. It happens. It's all dog. good. Uh, over the weekend, what happened? You uh, you did another premiere for your documentary. How'd that go? I did not go. Oh, okay. Uh, but it did <laughs> win. Well, you're okay. I'm not saying you had to be there, but you're, it, it, it's continuing I, I, in its progress. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. it got uh, it, it won the the feature best length fucking documentary thing. So it did really good. It's a, it's another accolade that's really good for people that want to buy it and blah, 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 blah. But yeah. uh, there's much more behind the scenes that's going on. So um, That was put on by Frankie Egger? Was that? It was Fra- presented by Frankie Egger. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Frankie was the, the host. Yeah. For real? Yeah. So everybody yeah. loved it. Super emotional, obviously. I just, I mean, I'm done with it. Um, when it gets out there, it gets out there. I can't wait for it to get out there So just so it reaches people. But, you know, I don't like pulling on my emotional strings like that. Gotcha. So. Uh, I haven't been here in a week. What, what the hell is going on with you? Just training? Just training, dog. Just plug <laughs> no, it off. I got many, uh, many knuckle came out of small Ooh. gloves and cut me. But it's like, it's superficial. Okay. It's, a, right, oh, it's right. an old little cut I had, like from like 10 years ago. I got palmed when yeah. I first started jujitsu. Yeah. And I never got it stitched. I All just right. got it glued, so. Yeah, I'm looking like, damn, nah, what the fuck nah, I have? Nah. I'm like, it's far not till today nah, or some shit. Nah, nah. All right. Uh. Like I said, I had some shit going on the last couple of days, so I did I did not watch this card at all. I'm a, I hope you guys watch this card. Anything from this card that besides the bite, I saw the bite. Keep that hunter. I didn't watch this card. I watched it, it was just I, it was a ten o'clock card. It came on late. Yeah, I, didn't I was watch not it I was not staying up. Um Did you see the biting incident? I seen the bite. Is that crazy to you? <sighs> yeah. Frustration? Like, he was but my thing is like he was pushing the guy. Like when someone gets bit, usually it's like it's like they're um, caught up in a weird caught up in a weird spot, like the guy's arms around their face. Like he was on the guy's back and like and fucking bit him. And imagine throwing your whole like Dana said, like they, they, <laughs> he can't do business with you, but he's cut. Like, he's cut. Uh, La- paid. Las Vegas is holding his purse. No, yep. bro, bro, it's in the rules. You can't bite. Like yeah, he's like, he's that's done. Like carnivore shit. Dog. He's, yeah, he's done. He's done. He. Uh, <laughs> what do they call that? Uh, cannibal. Cannibal. Cannibal shit. Yeah, he said yeah, carnivore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jonathan's diet. <laughs> he talking about I ain't doing it. Yeah. The fucking bite mark was clear as day. Right. Like I was like, dog, you could do a yeah. T fucking but, um, on this. Yeah, that card. Nothing else? No. Rose fight? Anybody watch it? Did you see that? Uh, I, I did. Um, I'm happy she won. Mm-hmm. I feel like she won. Uh, yeah, it, was, it wasn't that exciting, though. No. Um, I only caught that fight, uh, and I think like two other fights. Um, but yeah, no, I mean, it wasn't it wasn't that great of a card to me. So I didn't. I, like I said, just didn't. We're and all, I also can't. We're all venturing down to Atlantic City though this weekend. Besides Kurt, <laughs> we will be in Atlantic City. Yo, them tickets are cheap. Them tickets were expensive when I looked at first. I have not looked lately. The most expensive ticket in the arena is seven hundred dollars. The most expensive ticket. No way. I thought I was looking at like floor shit. The, <laughs> no, I like the most expensive ticket I seen on the floor was like seven hundred bucks. Where y'all sitting? Uh, wherever the UFC puts me. Oh, we're, you only we're in the free, free as me. Free nah, as me. We're, yeah. free as me. <laughs> we're. I would. I would think that we're probably in the, the fighter section. Yeah, but. Uh, bro. There's mad tickets available. Like it's yeah. not like a. But it's a, if you like the more I've been looking at it, like it's a good car. Like I'm gonna have. I'm gonna be there first fight of the night because Andre's the second fight. Okay. Yeah. I'm going down there. I'm gonna get dinner with my dad mm. and Kristen, and then we we're gonna go, go watch the fight. Go to Nugget. What's Kristen there? booked out Morton's. Oh, Morton's yeah, 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 is it good? Yeah. Wasn't there a monster killed out of Morton's in Philly or Harlem? <sighs> Probably. Who? who got shot? John, who got? Did somebody get shot in, the, in his head? <laughs> a monster. Did one of the monster killed outside of Morton's Steakhouse? Yeah. You know which one it was? Here, what's your mafia? Your, your IQ. If Haskell was here, he'd be all. He over. Order, he right? loves it. <laughs> it was a boss. He loves it. Was it was one of the bosses, the famous pitcher, I think. One that morning. At AC? Nah, I think it was in New York. It was a New Yorker. Oh, Morton's is like a um a chain. Not I, like a chain. I believe they it's a pop. Couple... I could be completely wrong, and I will edit it out if I am. So uh, don't even. <laughs> but anyway, no, we're gonna be there. We're gonna be there supporting our boys. Yeah. So where do you want to start at on this card? Up to y'all. I think we should do Andre last. All right. And we so, got two in this car. We got yeah, so we'll do, as well. Let's start off in the main event. Aaron Blanchfield versus Manon Furo, however you say her name. I'm picking Aaron Blanchfield. I, I am think too. she's going to grapple her up. I am too. I think just because of the way she's gone out there and like shown how resilient and persistent she is. She's tough, man. So The way she beat um, Jessica Andrade, I thought she was going to get fucking cooked in there. Yeah, and she's starched. Yeah, yeah. She's fucking good. This um, would be a classic. Too, she, and, uh, Manon is a striker, correct? More of a striker yes, versus the grappler, yes, right? Yes, yes. But Aaron's showed that she's improved on the feet, and um, she's a New Jersey girl. 
getting her first main event, so I'm excited for her. And um, yeah. where, is she, where is she turning? Where, like uh, Silver Fox. It's a Henzo school. Oh, okay. I, well, I know another her, her whose name we won't say. Yeah, it's it's a <laughs> it's a so it's a Silver Fox. Got gotcha, you, uh, got gotcha. you. So, but they're they're super legit. Her coach is really good, and um, yeah, I'm riding with her. Yeah, I'm going the same thing, Aaron Blanchfield. I think she can get the submission, by the way. I think so, too. Yeah. I think so. Um, Vicente Luque versus Joaquin Buckley. This is going to be a good fight, but I'm picking Vicente. I think Vicente's been fighting a lot smarter as of late. I think he'll mix in. If if he stands there and tries to bang, like, we've seen that Vicente as of late, like, his chin, like, obviously he got knocked out by Jeff Neal, but before that, his chin was fucking, like, of legendary shit. He was in some crazy wars and never got dropped, never got finished. So he's only been finished once, but um, Joaquin can crack. So I'd like to see Vicente be smart, mix up his striking with his takedowns. And um, yeah, I think that's his path to victory. What if I told you, let me see, looking at this. I'm going, I'm just going to say, I think a live dog is going to be Joaquin Buckley. For sure. I, th- I think he can clip him. For sure. And I don't think he can grapple with him whatsoever. But I'm also going to be biased because I like striking. Mm-hmm. And I think uh, Vicente is a good striker and probably a better striker. But I'm going to go with where the power side is. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to – you know, he's a hungry dog at 170. So we'll see how he does. But I would like to see the switch up in the welterweight division too. So I'm going Joaquin Buckley by – KO. And it's three five, so he can kind of he can kind of go, you know. What is he? Plus what? Plus one twenty four as of yesterday. Yesterday, what we had from our cards. What you got next? I think it depends on what Vicente shows up. Yeah, sometimes sure. he looks great. Hundred uh, percent. Joey can take the next one. It's a middleweight fight. Our mm. boy Chris Weidman versus uh, Bruno Silva. Bruno Silva's. Uh, it's hard for me to say. I, I mean, I, I don't like the way Chris Weidman looked against Brad Tavares. I think Bruno Silva's a little bit better than Brad Tavares. He just fought. Um, even though they did fight, and uh, I'm pretty sure Brad TKO'd him. But, I don't know, he TKO'd Brad, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he did. So, I mean, basically, he's on a two-fight skid, but I'm going to go Bruno Silva. I think he's going to kick the shit out of him. Um, what did you think of Bruno's last performance against... I'm just going to say the eyeball. Against uh, uh, sh- Shadow Bob. I saw that, I saw that, bullet, I saw that MMA theory. Yeah, uh, the bullet. John too. I mean, I, bro, <laughs> for a guy that's not a wrestler, um, yeah, I mean, he's not a wrestler, right? And mm-hmm. he took him down and he kept him down. And I feel like he won. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think he looked great. You felt uh, like Bruno won? Yeah, I thought Bruno won. Okay. I, you know, he was able to take him down and keep him on his back for two rounds. Um, I do remember that, yes. So, I mean, I think he exposed a very, very, very... You want to talk about hype train? That man is a hype train. It's because he's got one eye. He's a redhead. He's a Russian. And, you know, he is. He's badass. And he, he's tough. But uh, I think he looked great. And um, I do think that he's going to beat Chris, unfortunately. <sighs> That's a tough one, man. That's a tough one. But I'm going to pick Chris to mix it up, go in there. Score some takedowns and get the win. I truly, I'm. A good I, man, my so heart man. wants Chris Wilder <laughs> to win. So if he wins, I'll be, I'll be jumping in the crowd. I, I, I believe in him. He's man. a big underdog, and uh, Chris Weidman by decision. Do you think if, if Chris doesn't pull, he, he's done after yeah, this? Yeah, yeah, for sure. But um, the way he's talking, I, I mean, I think it should be. He wasn't even talking. Like, actually, I think the, I, he was on Ariel's show, and Ariel was bringing that up, and he was like, "I'm not even like." Yeah, he said he he's like, young. "I'm not even concerned about that." So, like, the way I like his mindset going into this fight, and um, I think it's a good matchup for him. Yeah. Everyone's like, oh, like, they put him with Bruno. Like, anyone above, anyone 155 pounds and up, they hit hard, and they have, anyone can knock you out. Like, everyone has the power to knock somebody out. So, um, yeah, like, you can't, especially 185 when these guys are cutting down from 200 and something pounds. Like, that's, that's a known thing. So, um, yeah. every person you get put in there with can knock you out. <laughs> But um, yeah, I, I like Chris in this one. We'll skip Nurse Town. We'll go back uh-huh. to him. <laughs> Bill uh, Algio, Kyle, Kyle Nelson, Bill Algio. I'm still going with Bill Algio. Bill Algio by decision. I think he's got the volume for it. Yeah, so. Bill's got a weird style. I like it, like the way he like moves mm-hmm. and he's got like a swagger about him. So this next fight, I'm actually interested in. I'm Chidi, very interested in Chidi. Chidi Kwan. Chidi by knockout. First round knockout. I agree. I agree. First round knockout. He comes out hot. Damn. And it's down at 170. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's why I'm excited about it. Like, he's, a, he's yeah. taller than like yeah. 
and he was he's a pretty yeah. thick dude, and he's going all the way down the welterweight. Who do you have last fight? Uh, 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 I think Michelle. Uh, no, um, no, 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 no. He got he got beat by Rodriguez, and then he got beat by LJ Check. I think LJ Check. Yeah, LJ Check. So he's been beaten on a three fight schedule. He got beat by Dariah, oh, Rodriguez, Dariah. and LJ Check. But I think the problem is just like his pace. He comes out way too hot, and then that he kind of. When it starts getting tough and he re- like they realize, oh shit, this is, I got to fight fifteen minutes. He kind, it seems like he's kind of wilted. But do you notice uh, who he's, his opponent? Yeah, Rise McKee got fucking absolutely obliterated <laughs> yeah. by uh, Kamsat Shemaev in like the oh, first round. Well, he got caught and then he got brought back. I don't yeah. know how he got brought back, but yeah, I'm picking um, Chidi by first round knockout. Yeah. On this next fight, when did Jamal Emmer step in for this? When Pat pulled out. Okay. And um, I, yeah, I'm picking Jamal Emers. I've been on the I am Jamal Emers. Seems like he's kind of J- Jamal Emers. I thought he beat Jack Jenkins yes. in that fight. He j- just knocked out Dennis Bazooka, mm-hmm. and before that, if you look at it, he lost to Pat. And before he got submitted by Pat, he fucking floored him. Yeah. So this dude, yeah. this dude, he's, he's good. Bro. He's well rounded. I think he's just going to be a step ahead of. I um, like Nate the train. Baby. I love him, but I don't think he's winning this. fight. I'm going Jamal Emers too, but Andy, I, yeah. I just want Andy Nate the Philly. train to win just so he can talk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm out oh, here, baby. Yo, that's really how I take like Nate the train. <laughs> Nate the it's train. Like Paul I'm Paul, here bro. to get it done. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, who's next? Verna Jandarum. <laughs> I'm picking. I'm picking Lupe. I'm not much confidence, but I'm picking Lupe. I, I think Lupe. I think Lupita can do it. I think. She, Godinez is definitely better. I don't see Verna being strong enough. She's going to purely have wrestling, and that's it. So yeah. if she can't get to it, which Lupita can wrestle, yeah. and she's kind of coming into her own with her win streak, I'm going Lupita Godinez. Julio Arce versus Herbert Burns. Julio Arce, that's who I'm picking. He has a 95% takedown defense. Um, Herbert's not going to be able to get him down. And Herbert the pervert. <laughs> <laughs> you know Herbert? <laughs> oh, yeah, man, got, bro. That shit. You ever seen the one where it's his, uh, oh, he like, I got some popsicles in the deep freezer if you want some. Yeah. <laughs> you like popsicles? Yeah. Chris hat fell off his head uh, one time and he smelt it. <laughs> he was like, <laughs> I don't want uh, more. <laughs> he said, wait, what did he say? He said, please, God, just give me something. I'll be happy. The, the wind blows. He gets the hat. He's like, uh, now I want more. <laughs> Yo, that's my shit, uh, bro. Anyway, um, <laughs> Julio Arce is, comes from a good team. And Tiger Shulman's, they got really good guys. And um, they got really good, nice striking. They got really good kickboxing. And, uh, yeah, I think Julio Arce, he's a huge, he's like a minus 600, so. Mm. Um, next fight, Dennis Bazooka versus Connor Matthews. Yes, who? <laughs> <laughs> I know, are you still riding with your boy Dennis Bazooka here? Yeah, That's yeah, I am. I, I'm. I, that is, I am being biased in this pick. Um, I don't know anything about Connor Matthews, but mm. yeah, I'm gonna ride with uh, Dennis just because I follow him. I see him. He trains really hard. He trains with good people. And I what does he have only... going on with uh, his record? Is he just like tough? Who? Dennis right now. He's uh he got one one was like a a bullshit call where he wasn't really knocked out and they kind of stopped it way 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 too early. Okay. He got floored and as he was getting up they stopped it. Um I'm pretty sure that that's how the one went. He definitely did get his uh butt whooped on the one. Um but yeah, man, I'm going to I'm going to pick Dennis because I've seen <laughs> who he's training with. Yeah. He trains with Al Jermaine, he trains and his back's up against the wall. He's on a two fights kid. He just got in the UFC like he needs a win. So uh, I assume he's gonna be bringing Yo, wait, everything he's got. Grab, grab, the, grab, grab this. I moved. I didn't. Know this you, is for you fans. I actually put some thought into this. Don't be like <laughs> Kurt, where you just fucking interrupt me during a, a very detailed breakdown. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, but yes, I do think Dennis. Yeah. Okay. I'm Hold on. Give me one second. That's how we got. Boy. <laughs> What's up, dog? Don't what worry time? about that. Don't worry about it. What's up? We screen. start. I don't know. Same time, it. bro. We, we gotta put you in the in the chat. We gotta put you in the Sheesh. chat. If you're official, which you're getting a lot of movement yeah, under, the, under the YouTube comments. I don't know if he's official though. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. If, if this official. thing becomes if you you're like on a trial period, they said. They say. <laughs> Sheesh. But if it becomes official, we gotta put you in the chat. I'm picking Connor Matthews, by the way. Um he trains mm. with um Did you just do like a quick assessment? No, no, no. I oh, just I, no, I know. He trains with um he trains with Rob Font and those guys out in uh, the New England cartel. Yeah. Okay. He's a good grappler. One second. I got to frame you in. You guys can go ahead. I'll just, I'll just... What's up, Sean? <laughs> Coming in here with these fucking Vietnamese feet. It's wild, bro. Damn. 
And I was on the phone. I talked to him twice yesterday. I told you Wednesday. Did I or did I not? Wednesday at what time? Did so I or did I not tell time? you Wednesday? Did it, I or did Wednesday. I not? Well, what Justin, time? I got you. It's always it's always you between eight thirty and nine. And did listen, I did I or did I, I not tell you? My for hat that I this is yeah. Did I or go. did I not? <laughs> Take his dick out, your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, ain't nobody been dick riding me since I take lost. Take his so dick I'm out your yeah. mouth. <laughs> and he got that nut ass skin mark under his eye. Yeah, Fuck all right. He here. got stains all up on them fucking basketball shorts, dirt bag, the football shorts. Fuck Pervert. out of here, nut they face. Make for- they make football shorts. Yeah, yeah, football <laughs> shorts. Yeah, shorts. <laughs> <football>. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> anyway, where Bob Sponge face? Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're doing it. It was not my fault. It was my situation. I hey, yo, I'm, stay, yo, I'm telling it, you right now. How's I'm that going, going on. Curve is everything okay? Everything gonna be good. Yeah, I'm how, telling how you, how you right say now. this next dude's name? I don't Abu? know. Ibu. Uh, uh, I'm picking Ibu. I'm ba- going to Ibu. Got knocked out. I'm it. I'm Shout out. Shout Chanel out hair there. time, baby. Yeah, the hair play. I'm picking your boy right in a couple months. I'm picking Ibu by knockout. I think these dudes have fought before. Um, really? Yeah, they did fight. Who see. won? Oh, he, uh, brave. Okay, he submitted this guy. And, su- all right, Anton, Anton submitted him. Yeah, I'm man? still picking. Yep. I'm still picking a boot and knock him out. Me too. I don't like the Pleasure Man's name. I, oh, I fought, just don't like Fort Regionals. Fort. Yeah, they fought yeah. brave. All right, yeah. let's move into Andre Petrowski versus Jacob Malkoon. This is your weight class, Joey. Break it down. All right, I'm gonna give you guys. You know, I'm. I'm I'm going to be biased as far as who I want to win, but I'm going to give you guys my honest opinion. I think Andre can, this is a gimme fight. I think he could beat him. Um, I don't think Malcoon can strike whatsoever. I think he's fucking terrible on the feet, but he is a hammer when he is on top. He can wrestle his ass off. He does have cardio for wrestling, um, but he doesn't really have cardio if you stuff it. We've seen if he's able to be stopped, that he gets really laboring, gets really mm-hmm. desperate, and then he starts making really, really big mistakes. But uh, I think it's going to be a battle who can establish the takedown. Andre was not the best cardio, but he's been doing nothing but drawing wrestling. I don't really know what's been going on in his camp, but, I mean, my heart goes out to him, and I hope he wins, and obviously uh, been training with him for a long time. So, But uh, I will lean towards Andre. I think he can get the decision. Um, but I just hope that he doesn't let Jacob Malkoon ever settle on top of him because I do think that Jacob has really good ground and pound. So decision in this fight, over one and a half, Andre Petrowski. Do you want to go real quick? Um, okay. he's just about he that, right? On everything, okay. Yeah. Does has anyone spoken to Andre since his last fight with uh, Michelle Pereira? Did, yes. Does anybody know how his mindset works coming off of a loss versus some? Like, I don't think off? it's going to bother him whatsoever. Yeah. He got he got a new contract. He got a bunch of money. Um, it was something that has you know he was trying to get for a while, which was a new contract, and you know he's got new fights and he's in a good spot. So, um, Alex. <laughs> It, it, it has actually like matured in a good way because Michelle Pereira has obviously gone and knocked oh, out. Oh, yeah. I, I think Pereira, I'm just laughing at this. Dude. I, didn't know what <laughs> I think Pereira is going to be a contender at middleweight like very soon. Yeah. yeah. For him to do what he just did to the last guy, and then, yeah, he's on a nice little, yeah. nice little roll. He's going to be. He's and Andre be, knows. He lost under. Uh, fucking sure, 20 sure travel hours from of Thailand travel to here to there, like that shit fucks you up. No uh, training, yeah. So just make sure he, there's no, the, no, it's the pride of Delco. He's going to win. <laughs> yeah, pride of Delco. Baby. Listen, are they Philly guys? Did, did I'm not Delco, Philly guys. The Delco Death Stare. <laughs> <laughs> Taking my brother. <laughs> 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 He's um, got it. Next one, Nursultan. I'm gonna keep this one simple. Wait a minute. How do you say his Some name? Nur- Nursultan. Uh, no, because I always call him Knock, Nursultan. Knock, Nursultan. Knockout. Could Again? be a submission, Under one but half. he's knocking him out. Under one Straight half. right, right down the middle. Yeah. He's flooring this dude. Yeah. Or Nurse Tom is very hard to submit, and um, he's got good submission defense I, and submission offense, too. Like, he goes for good submissions. He doesn't look it. He's strong if he as gets his shit. You, he you, has you, a, felt, you, he had, you personally are saying that from your personal Yes, yes, yes. His grip is strong. Like, this is a very good fight for him, and yeah. I would take him by finish. Who's he fighting? Twenty one Savage, Cedricus <laughs> Dumas. Yeah, how do you say to say that? Cedricus <laughs> Dumas. Yo, uh, you know why? I knew, yo, Norsolton is a bad dude because he's shaking. No, yeah, some whatever. Was, however, people say. do pronounce it uh, like that, he, that uh, online. Listen, he shakes I'm, your hand I'm with not, both I'm hands. I'm just saying. No, 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 no. I'm just okay. saying. <laughs> he shakes your hands with both hands. That's a dangerous dude, bro. <laughs> he yeah. does go like this. I feel uh, yo, like he's always sliding me a dollar. That's a power. That's a power move. They're very, they're very respectful. The yeah. Uzbek guys. Yeah. He is the, by far the most popular Uzbekistan walking in. Dude's got a right mi- yeah. Well, I mean, their country is the size of fucking Northeast Philly, so. <laughs> Bro, and he's honestly, a super 
superstar. He's become one of my favorite people. I love him. That's my boy, as bro. As a presence in the gym. Bro, he's, a, he's, he's the best. He's yeah. not a dickhead training not partner. And these dudes are in here during, he's in here during, during Ramadan, Ramadan, like not, Fasting, though. Yes. Have you, uh, have you personally, because I haven't been there, have you guys gotten any work for this camp? Before Ramadan started, Before? yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. nice. now they're only coming in at a certain time. Um, they come in around like five, like right after they can drink some water. They train and then they go and then they eat. So Bro, right before Ramadan this boy's started, got we're zero training. weight cut probably. Yeah. <laughs> Last week I was ordering Uber Eats. I never changed my address Fat from ass. here <laughs> from here to uh, my crib. You sent it here. It got sent here. It was plov. It was from the rest from the uh, Uzbeki restaurant. You were upset when I say people like they they sent it somewhere else. I called them. I was like, Yo, can I just pay you to bring it to my house? I, I gave them twenty five dollars in the end, right? But when he got here, they were Uzbek. I was like, Yo, I was like, they was like, Well, what? You know, we trying to communicate. I had to get my wife to talk. But um, I was saying, I was like, yo, do y'all know like Nusatan? Bro, when I say popular, they go crazy. They like, give they you the like, $25 back? No, I gave me $25. <laughs> no, no, but no, listen, no. I got a message in my he phone. He ain't that popular then. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't remember if he did. Maybe I did say no, brother, like take whatever. But they was like, Nusatan, what are you doing? They got hyped. Like, it was like, I was like, you know, Nusatan, like that's his gym. This is not what I right? <laughs> so I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, that's his gym. I showed him pictures. I'm like, I do photography. Yeah. I work with him, but. They were like hype as shit. And then he wrote me this message. You could tell it's translated. He was like, brother, I want to show you all the Uzbek dishes. Please let us dine at Hall. We dine after Jumar or you something You know what's like cool that. about him is I still feel like we all know him very well. We know him in our training aspect. Yeah. I know him. Sean knows him. Like I've trained with him a lot. And uh, like he's never been a dick to me. But it's like we still don't know how hard this guy goes. You, you know what it you is? What I mean? when, like, when his English update... His English shit kick in, yeah. it's gonna be on the podcast. I didn't know homie had 40, 44 fights under his belt. Man, man I didn't fights. know that. Oh, he's yeah. got some sick highlights too. He's a man. But um, <laughs> yeah, Nurse Otan by finish. We're talking that, about this P. Diddy stuff. <laughs> nah, no. You know, he's playing in the new Batman as the Diddler, right? <laughs> Oh, I saw that yeah, shit. The fucking yeah, when he's wearing yo, green, he's running. It's a bad day to be Pity. P. P. Diddy. That shit be cracking up. Bro, yo, I'm not gonna lie. All this shit. Cent? I'm not gonna say any like like, like details. I can't, I can't. But dude. You know how fucked up I am about it? It's bothering me because I love the song I'll Be joke. Missing You. No, uh, can't I can't listen to that shit no more. What about yeah. Nickelodeon? I can't listen to right. that. No I heard that's some time, crazy time, shit going on. Yeah, they're sucking toes and shit on. Y'all don't listen to Kells? R. Kelly can't get a play from y'all? No. Nah. Yeah, nah. you're right. Section yeah. part one and two is my jam, bro. <laughs> you, do you still listen to Michael Jackson? Hell yeah. yeah. Come on, yo, bro. Do you know, yo, do yo, you know? He was, as he as was as diddling the fiddling, too. <laughs> yeah, but yo, as long you know as, as he was a diddler, bro. come on. You, but that came do out you know, after he died. You know, they they made a snack for him, for Michael Jackson. What do you mean? They made little Debbie hee hee hee. Yeah, why do you have to do that to me? Because now it's going to bother me. is a dad. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm, that, that's what I'm saying. Like, if you're going to... Don't if, tell me if that. Let Mike live. Yo, me, me came on Freak yesterday. Bills. I'm not doing that. I, I, I'm not, I, hit, I'm not. I, hit, I hit pass. Yo, I'm not... Yo, I'm not, I'm not, not I, I, bro. I hit pass. How can you... They I can't, said Dreams I can't. and Nightmares was about Diddy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, nah, oh shit! I still oh, love me. You gotta change. You gotta change your walk. As long as listen, me can be me can be whatever you want. As long as he's no. not sex trafficking kids, I don't care what you. Wait, Meek's in your walkout song? I thought it was DJ Khaled. But it's Meek and, and yeah. Meek. Oh mm -hmm. shit! That's because I've, I've always walked out to Meek. I'm not gonna say don't came out. No more. I, I've walked out <laughs> to Meek Mill. Oh yeah. Yeah. All right, let's not shit on him. You never know. It's all speculation, man. Went to Andrew Schultz comedy show. Going, he shit on you, right? Who's going in on me? It was funny though. It, like it was funny. It was. He's hilarious. Oh, you went against? It's like no, no, no. no, 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 no that, 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 uh, it was on YouTube. I saw it. I saw like the uh, aftermath. He's a comedian, shit. Andrew Schultz. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm not familiar him. with him. He, he, he's kind of got like a like a gray yeah. hair, right? No, no, no. no? I don't fucking. That I went, bro, is funny. We went to his show. Fucking two days later, massive shootout outside the Met. Three, like four people got you ever shot. Been to the Met? Was that's that first like time three times a week. First time at the Met. On Broad, on Broad Street. Street. It's, it's like three times a week up there, dude. Down at the Met, right? And yeah, they make the you. Yeah, who, who? Me and Simon had to leave our guns in the car too. I'm like, God damn it. Oh no, I will take my shit. There's a fucking metal detector. You're just gonna be watching shit. the show. Honestly, well, no, I'm gonna have to teach you how to. Yeah, don't don't. He puts it in his ass and then walks right through. Yo, I would teach you how to make a sharp pencil. What mobster was shot outside the steakhouse? Paul Castellano. Here we go. Was it Morton? Was it Morton? No, was it Morton? Oh, all right, we wrong. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. What was the name of Steakhouse? You remember? Justin just made that shit up. You can see him. No, searching. no. Now you got me. No, I. No, it's I think no, it's I know it. Um, Sparks. 
Sparks, that's what it's called. You're right. Sparks Steakhouse. I just watched Get Gotti or whatever. Where is that? Was. Get, yeah, it's good, it was right? good, right? It's good. Manhattan. Good. I watched that whole thing. Yeah. He Wait, put me on to it. Put, Hold listen, on. Why, why, did you, why did you mention that steakhouse, though? That's not that. Because he said Morton's. I thought, I thought, listen, I thought the boy got shot out of something. I'm very big with mafia shit. I turned my man Brady on. I said, you got to start listening to this shit. It's crazy how, how it fucking crazy this shit is. How powerful organized crime was in America between like 1950 and like 1980. Like how they infiltrated everything, dude. It was nuts. We had a mafia too, just so you know. Who? BMF. Black people? No, not uh, BMF. No, BMF. Not BMF. You blow money fast? You mean the JBM? All and the- I didn't mean who as in black people. I meant who <laughs> as in Philadelphia. Yeah, the no, J- no, no. There was a Philly mob too, right? There was a Philly mob. The one black mafia... They killed Kareem Abdul Jabbar's son. That, they drowned him in a tub. Yeah. Yeah. They, they drowned him where? They, they, they drowned him in a tub. When at Muhammad Ali's old house? You look, I, you look like you were drowned in a tub. I would, especially with that Skidmore body <laughs> ride. <laughs> and then they have, um, you had Damn. the JBM off of Paxson Street in South in Southwest Philly. <sighs> they Baby, drowned you know, his was, kid. Yeah, it was it was messy. I think. And they I, had Ram, they I thought had, they. I thought you said they drowned him. No, they drowned. Oh, they the drowned kid. his kid. Yeah. Then they had. You had Ram Squad, the Richard L. Mafia that was tied with like Joey Merlino. I remember Ram Squad. They had them jeeps riding around. God them. damn. Um, one thing I did want to back back on some Mar- Mighty Mouse. How cool was that? Did you just do shit? Tough, right? Yeah. Did you see the opponent? Yeah. Big yeah. Ass yeah. Dude? yeah. Yeah. That that was. I thought that was pretty like. Wait. Just, wait. just for him to be entering like the the IBJJF and like mm-hmm. doing good in it is like is cool. I just want to say, I fucking killed it last week, dude. <laughs> Kurt tried to look over my shit. No, I did. My, my mind's a lot of places. How well did you do? I think I only got one wrong, right? You did. Or no, I you did. said they got. I, they got I, remember, I remember showing that. Steady picks done fucked up, and they put the Ramos one, and I didn't pick Ramos, I don't think. Did no, you? I think I would have won. Nah, that, we, right? we, I picked Ramos? You picked Ramos. Did I? Mm-hmm. Did you guys see the video mm-hmm. that I just sent it to Coach great. John? They're cooking. They're cooking the coaches for North Todd's last fight. When he jumps up on the oh cage Lord. and someone goes four fingers deep into his ass. Yo, someone did stick their <laughs> fingers was, all the way was, in Nurse Todd's ass. It was for Dob, man. <laughs> yeah. It was for Dob. Oh, shit. I, I think it was the John. Glo- the, glo- yeah. the glove had a... The, the glove I had think a it was John. It. Yeah. So they couldn't figure out who it was, but then they remembered for Dob glove had a hole in it. And his shit, like the way his hand landed, yeah. holding him up on the cage, he was plugged. He was diddied up. So <laughs> he was getting ready. Yo, he was getting ready to throw a. He tried to throw a knuckleball, bro, for real. Yo, it was one of my fights, and uh, I'm not gonna name my three corner men. You know who they? Are. It was a picture of me and them, and they were like, "Yo, Sean got a thick ass corner." My boys were thick, heavy ass corner, like probably 1,500 pounds. Damn, them boys were big. 500 a piece. 500 a piece. 500 apiece. Oh, uh, but yeah, no. Nurse was on this weekend. Andre mm-hmm. this weekend. It's going to be a. a I'll, I'll be in AC. Now, Joe will be in AC. If you guys are there, come say what's up to us. Now, so Sean, I got a is, question for. Okay. My bad. You know, no, no, go ahead. Privileged. <laughs> <laughs> are you valeting the truck? I'm not driving my truck. Nah. What do nah. you got? Really? Uh, I'll take Kristen's car. Damn. The yeah. Rav 4. Oh, no, it's not Rav 4. No, she got. She got mm-hmm. You can't say. You can't give back her old Rav 4. She's. She yeah, grew up. Yo, we're always missing the Yo, Brad Ford's are tough. <laughs> they are. Um, Don't disrespect nah, I'm not the bank my, account. I'm not driving my truck, bro. I can't like when when you get in those parking lots and they like, get nervous, bro. I can't go in them now. Simon's one. Um, we were. It was one of my fights. He had an F one fifty, and it's nowhere near as high as my truck. And but they had the same dual sunroof. Yeah. Yo, we were like this close, bro. I'm like, nah, I'm never driving my I truck. I have to. That's oh, you should definitely cut it. I have to now. You wishing if I was laying in a flatbed, you would have a full foot. <laughs> <laughs> this is about the end. Yeah, sure. Yeah, all right. We, we, read the end. we got three. <laughs> question for you. Hurry up. What about the Luke A. Buckley fight? We already talked about it. Luke mm, A. Damn, that's because yeah. I'm an hour late. Thanks, yeah. Sean. Thanks, Sean Brady. We're all we don't wait, bro. Guy. We don't wait. Steady picks. Sign up. Roll tide. <laughs> Roll time. What time did we start? What time was